issue of race and gender. So you see that in English football, an astonishing 40% of players are black in the Premier League. And in the NBA, it's, it's much higher. It's about, it's close to two thirds. But what you don't see is black people in senior roles off the field. They're massively up. What, the rule, of course, the shibboleth of football is you have to play to be a manager. It's ridiculous, but that's the way clubs recruit. And so ex-players become managers, but not black ex-players. So you see a massive underrepresentation, 11 times underrepresented uh, black people in management versus black people on the field. And in the NBA, it's st they're still underrepresented, but they're far more black managers and general managers. Now, how to fix this? Uh, one idea of the last 20 years was the Rooney Rule, which was uh, brought in by the NFL, where clubs have to interview um, black people when, op when jobs open up. Now, it hasn't really worked in the NFL, which is two-thirds black players, and only two out of 32 head coaches are black. So I was talking to the Black Footballers Partnership. They say it's time for compulsory quotas, much like the mandatory percentage of women on corporate boards, which has been uh, made law in multiple European countries. That the Black Footballers Partnership say, and I agree, is I think the only way to break through this shocking discrimination that we're seeing.